Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Curry's Adventure. It's level 7, Rainbow Resort. We're looking good. Ah, cool. Some good uses of the laser power here. All the... Uh, I guess what would you call... I don't want to call them slopes necessarily, but... I guess they kind of are. Just all the inclines and stuff. Yeah, I got it. This kind of makes the level rather easy. Yeah, we're stuck and got in that uh, one up. Sweet. It's kind of a cool place. Ah, well, this is kind of lame. How can they include that uh, kind of sliding thing? Not all the Kirby's actually have that. And, uh, you'd have to like get a power in order to get blocks beneath you. Anyways, how's everyone doing today? Nice day to be recording. It's uh, kind of not that nice outside, so it's, it feels like a good day to stay in the me. Uh, not the best of timing to feel like that, considering it's homecoming here uh, at my school at my college. So, I mean, there's a lot of people I could be seeing, but I don't know. I'm just not I'm not feeling very social right now. Feels like a curl up with some hot chocolate, play some video games, or you know something like that. Here I am playing Kirby, and I was thinking of recording some other stuff too, in addition to Kirby. I'm not sure what, um, maybe the mystery project I'm always talking about. Oh, that was quick. Well, how do you get up there? Eh, I don't care. Wow, he almost kicked my ass. <laughs> Could suck up that black and make him drop, but, eh. I should grab some ice power. I can take a minute and grab that. And freeze. Reminds me of Mr. Freeze. Did any of you guys ever see that Batman uh, movie with Mr. Freeze and Poison Ivy in it? I don't know why, but I really liked that one as like as a kid when I was younger. I and looking back, I mean it's not that good of a movie really. Plus it's weird having Arnold and Schwarzenegger being Mr. Freeze. Odd choice. Come on. Oh three. Eh, it's alright, I guess. I don't know. I always thought Poison Ivy was kind of hot in that. I, that was when I was younger. I don't know about now. Well, it's quiet. Weird. No, go in the door. Oh, is this a boss gauntlet, perhaps? Oh, I forgot I still have the freeze power. I don't really want that. Come on, we're gonna spit it out of this guy. And miss, apparently. I just don't care much for the freeze power for fighting bosses. I mean, if it was their weakness, it would be one thing, but... Alright, come on, Mr. Bomberman, let's do this. Give me your bomb, and I'll spit it out at you, and you'll be dead. Ah, uh, crash power. Let's do this. Pow! I wonder how much damage this will do to him. Oh, it'll one-shot him, apparently. Ah, the mic power. This will do some good damage to whatever boss we fight next. This is kind of like a silly level if they're going to give us all these good powers. Huh. Well, unfortunately, I don't have much of a choice to use that mic power. No. I'm going to keep the mic power. Because um, that'll do a lot of damage to the next boss. And I'll just fight him normally after that. Yeah. Rock and roll. See, one more shot and this guy will be dead. Sure, your little coconut. Not oh, a little closer. Yeah, hammer power. Not one of my favorites, but I'll take it. Better than start sticking the eye. As H.C. Bailey would say, Mr. Armadillo guy, no, fuck you. I almost destroyed my own power. No, I was not that close. God, how did I not die? I should have died. I'm not gonna go near that. 
I knew if I would have, he would have exploded on me. If I would have hit him, it probably would have. I don't know, probably would have killed me or something. Oh, uh, I don't think I'm gonna make it against this guy. Come on. Take a beating. Oh my god, I don't wanna die, so I'm being overcautious. Yep. And I'm dead. I hammered it a lot of damage to him, though. I wonder where I'll start. Oh, okay, good. We're next to him. Didn't think that was a checkpoint. I thought I was gonna have to go through all the fight again. No, I was trying to... I was hoping I could get two shots in a minute once, but... I guess not. Oh yeah, just barely. I didn't think that second was gonna hit him, I thought I was just gonna barely miss him. Come on, spit out more insects and I'll finish you. Yeah. It's good that it went right through him. Backdrop. Yeah, I don't care much for this one. But I'll take it I guess. Nope, go on the door. weird that it, I mean, instead of even canceling out the little star that he just put out, it just, I don't know, it disappeared. And one more hit. No, no, don't rape me or whatever you're doing. Damn. I was scared. Come on. One more. Let's dance. Done. How hard does he get? A fireball? I like fireball. Yeah. And we got a warp star. Wherever will we go? That's kind of nice. Looks like we're in space. Is this the moon, perhaps? Oh, maybe I should have grabbed that star sword power. Come on! Oh, Close. Oh well. Yeah, it's going on world three. World level, whatever. I'm just gonna float over these guys. They're just sleeping. No need to kill them. I'm not a murderer, I swear. So one of the one of the, my viewers pointed out the fact that this is actually the same as Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland for the Game Boy Advance. And uh, I didn't actually know that either. I thought that was kind of interesting. So if, if you're uh, curious to see this with a little bit of graphics, and um, the game plays a little bit differently, uh, check it out. Um, like I said, Kirby's Nightmare in Dreamland for Game Boy Advance. Same game. And, uh, I was... I If I would have thought of that, I might have done that instead of this version, but I kind of like playing playing this version just for nostalgia's sake, because I mean, I, I did play this as a kid and stuff like that, and I don't know, I'd, I'd, I'd like to play the original. Yeah, it's uh, candy time, whatever that is, a sucker, I guess, except for it's kind of hard to maneuver, because like, it's really awkward on platforms, and you float really slowly. I feel like I kind of wasted that. You're not getting me, Mr. Ice Guy. Well, you probably should have just then. Ooh, that was close too. Ah. Yeah, I think Cutter really is my favorite. And I'm gonna lose my favorite, apparently. Oh, that's great. Oh well. Parasol. No, I wanted the... I wanted the other one. I don't like Parasol. Ah, I knew that was gonna hit me. I was too slow to react. Yeah, that's what I wanted over the sword power. Thanks, game. Thanks. Oh, come on, what happened to all the ones I was getting? Hmm. More points, anyways. Uh, 
I think I'd get one up soon if I get a few more points. The 50,000 or 500,000, apparently. I'm gonna ditch this power, because I don't want it anymore. Not that I like the ball power either. I'd rather have the laser power. Well... Eh, I guess it's fine. I'll deal with it. What is that? Oh, it's the tornado one. I like the tornado one, but it kind of leaves you vulnerable after you use it, and I don't... I don't like that idea. Screw it. I don't feel like worrying about it and chasing after it. Die! I don't get why they put the ball power in here, it sucks. I mean, I think it sucks anyways. You guys like it? That's kind of weird. That's a little enemy gauntlet now. Kind of, I guess. Aw. Oh. Damn. I, I didn't mean to time that. Uh, hopefully that... It syncs right so it, you can hear it like I just did. Hopefully. I don't know. These days with Camtasia, I don't... Uh, sometimes it really likes to fuck me over. Just me, apparently. Well, I, I mean, I don't mean that. I say that because Dave never... Dave hasn't had a lot of the same troubles I have, I've had with Camtasia. Not that he's mentioned anyways. Just like with the video feed freezing and... Just, I don't know, weird shit. Alright, oh, I used that just in time not to get hit by those. Oh, this is weird looking. Ah, I knew that was gonna happen. I don't know why I wasn't more cautious. Come on, come here and get shocked by my spark attack. I don't know why, but I just thought of Final Fantasy X just now. Something just reminded me of it, and I don't know. Oh my god, run. Oh well. Sometimes I think about wanting to do an LP of that or something like that, but eh. I don't think I'd really... I don't know how much I'd really get into it. I don't know. <laughs> I'm real wishy-washy on that idea. Like, part of me would want to, because I do like that game. And I've played it quite a few times, so I mean, I could do a decent LP of it, but... I don't know. Oh, I didn't mean to shock him. I wanted to use his power. <laughs> I managed to get to these guys just in time. Oh, except that one. Oh, and that one, because I was busy floating. Good thing they didn't hit me. Oh, big tire. Look out for this guy. Got him. Oh, now we have the wheel power. Yeah. I was going to try and say yay, but that would have been false. I wouldn't have really meant it. Oh my god, I can't float, but I can, sure can't jump through that. Oh, I thought that was going to screw me and make me fall down the hole. That was happening a lot during the previous recordings I did of, uh, uh, episode 5 in, in the uh, Orange Ocean. Yep, just like that. That was happening a lot, and it was driving me absolutely crazy. Ugh. I wonder what the... Oh, I see. I think. Maybe the way the, the, way the, the, way the stars are pointing... Maybe that's where, like, yeah, there's up flow and down flow that you can move with. Please don't kill me. I would not like that. Come here. Get in my belly. No oh, killing me. We have things to do. We have kings to beat. I'll take fireball power, sure, why not? Fire power, specifically. Um, there's helium, I'm gonna go back and get it. Hopefully I can get it not be a noob. Oh, how come he can shoot me? Oh, great, no. Ah. Whatever, I don't care. Unless I have to. No, I don't care. Exit's right there. That's all I care about. Come on, number three. done with this world. Let's move on to world six. <laughs> I love it. Sweet. 
This is great. I enjoy Kirby games. I really do. Music's so happy. So happy. Yeah, I'm thinking I'll... This won't be the only Kirby game I'll play. I'll probably do others. Just, I just like the games. And like Kirby Jam Land 2, um, I would be a little more interested in LP of that, because I've, I've played that more than any other Kirby game. For, for the Game Boy, that is. And, uh... I mean, there's a little more of a walkthrough aspect, because you have to collect these uh, Dream Shards. I don't know why I try to do that. Um, along the way, in order to actually beat the game. Because there's the ending, and then there's the real ending. And the real boss fight and stuff like that. Um, so maybe I'll do that one. Who knows? But I've got Golden Sun to finish. I've got this to finish. And I've got Final Fantasy to six to work on eventually. And hopefully someday I'll do Final Fantasy IX. That's like a 12-hour run, like I've mentioned before in my videos. Um, who knows what else? I mean, I still want to do Dragon Force whenever that, whenever I get around to finding something that uh, is to my liking with that. As I've mentioned in previous videos, um, the audio is just not getting emulated properly, and I, I'm not okay with it. So, one of these days I'll, I'll get around to doing it. I might consider some other Sega Saturn games. I don't know why I like the idea so much of LPing Sega Saturn games. I think it's more because, I mean, it wasn't really a popular console, and so there's, I mean, there's not a lot of LPs of the games of, of the Sega Saturn out there. You know, just, just kind of like you wouldn't see a lot of shit. Oh, a lot of shit, yeah. You would see a lot of shit, actually. There's a lot of crappy Sega Saturn games. There's a lot of gems out there, too, don't get me wrong. But, uh, anyways. I like how this is all in black and white. I really do. It's got such a classic feel. Did you guys ever play, uh, Kirby 64? I don't remember. I think it has a proper title. I don't remember what, though. I never had it in 64 as a kid, so I never got the chance to play it, but I've seen it played. It looks alright. Maybe I'll play it someday. Who knows? Probably not for an LP or anything. But, uh, yeah. Ooh, a five. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of N64 games I'd like to get around to playing. Alright, it's boss time. Could it be King DDD himself this time? Why, yes, it is! Come on, let's fight! Wow, my cutter's not doing, like, anything to him. No! I was eating stuff. You can't eat me while I'm eating stuff. No eating inceptions. Oh, I thought he was gonna use his hammer. No, stay away. Stay away from the summoner! Yeah, I guess I can't hurt him with normal powers. Come on! That goes away really quick. Oh well. Hopefully we can beat him. Without dying. Oh, fuck you. Come on. Yeah. Halfway down, that's not bad. Oh, somehow his hammer absorbed the blow. Stay away from him. No, you're not eating me. Pop! Ah, that's a little too close for comfort. Come on. Looks like probably three more hits ought to do it. I didn't want to die. I didn't want to. I didn't want to. I just threw a mini temper tantrum, but you guys didn't get to see it. 
Oh well. Let's try this again. This time, it's gonna go super smooth. Yeah, do your little whatever. I don't know if you're tripping or if you're trying to dive at me. Either way, you suck. Yeah. Come on. Do your little jump. Just like that. Double damage. Ugh. I don't know. I should have stayed on the ground. I don't know why I did that. Because I'm dumb. Come on, hammer again. Ah. Got my hopes too high. Damn. This hammer absorbed the blow. Come on, he's already halfway dead. This is, this is easy. Then we'll save, we'll save Dreamland. Be the hero. Wow, I should have been hit from that. Glad I didn't though, because I got double damage on him. And he's done. We won. We kicked your ass. How's it feel? What? Well, seems we're not done. Level eight fountain of dreams. What is this? What? was your problem? No, we have stuff to do. No. Bad DDD. Yeah. You sit over there, and you deal with it. What? What is this? Oh shit. This looks bad. Maybe there's a reason he didn't want us to... Take that. Oh, I guess we're doing this! DD was trying to help us in the end. Well, so yeah, you just get the star red power, and you'll have this the entire time, and you're just shooting stars and dodging his stars. He takes a lot of hits, so, uh, you've gotta really wail on him. Hopefully, this doesn't take too many tries. Um, I don't remember if, if I happen to die, I don't remember whether or not. I'll get to start on this level or not. I think I do. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I think of some Kirby games, yeah, that wouldn't be permissible, but I think this one is okay. So far, this is going pretty well. I wonder if we'll have a second form. I really love this. Like, there's a similar fight in Kirby's Dream Land 2 against this thing, and it is really awesome. There's two phases to it. When you kind of get the star rod thing, and then another one you get a star sword, and that's really cool. And I died. Damn, I thought we were going to beat him. But he started switching up his attacks. Ah, let's try this again. A little bit longer episode is okay, considering this is the finale. Alright, I just decided to go ahead and skip this. Um, I didn't feel like making you guys watch that cutscene again. Come on, this time you are mine! 101, Kirby vs. Nightmare. Pew 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 pew. It's kind of a hard fight, because I mean, he does move around pretty fast, and, and those star attacks do switch up the patterns quite a bit. And, and they move fast enough where it's, it's hard to adjust, um, you know, before you see the attack. Or when you see the attack, rather. This time we're gonna get him. Almost got hit by that one. See, like that one, those just kinda went everywhere. Shit. This, at this fight, I would say a turbo button would be nice. Just because you can't really hold it down. Oh, I guess you can. That's cool. I didn't think you could. So I kept pressing it. Uh oh, where is he? What? Don't tell me that I'm gonna die. Really? I didn't know that. Oh my god, I killed him. After a million tries, I killed him. I can't believe it took me as long as it did. That was annoying. But we won! We've defeated the Nightmare in Dreamland. Uh, we win! What? Oh my god, there's still more. Oh, and we gotta fight him with one little health. That's good. 
Man, I, I just thought we had him. No, no. I knew there was this fight. Um, this is gonna be a little bit harder. Kinda funny looking guy. And we die. Good. Eh. Oh well. Yeah, I don't think I could. I'm gonna have to split this up in the second episode. I'll, uh, I'll catch you guys next time and we'll finish the last phase of, uh, defeating the Nightmare. Kirby's Adventure! This is the Unknown Gamer Guy, and thanks for watching. Bye!